Hello friends, welcome to the Global Institute of Agriculture GIA YouTube channel. I am Rajiv Kumar Behra, working as top officer in the Department of Agriculture Extension. I am here providing online free coaching through my online YouTube channel. I am also providing free study material through my website www.wisdomworld.co.in. Today, we are going to discuss what is University Extension System. Before knowing this, we should know what is Agriculture Extension. Agriculture Extension is the branch of agriculture which deals with the farmers improvement in their physical, economic and social well-being through individual and cooperative efforts. Okay, to improve the farmers, we have to improve their social ego status by means of individual and cooperative efforts. Okay, next, agricultural research and education get major support in the 20th century when Lord Curzon was the Viceroy of India. And an Im important milestone was established that is your IARI, shortly it is called as IARI and it full form is Indian Agricultural Research Institute, formerly it was called as Imperial. After independence, Imperial was changed into Indian. It was situated at Pusa, Bihar in 1905 when it was established. But in earthquake, when earthquake came in 1934, it was shifted to New Delhi in 1936, after two years. In 1905, six colleges were established at Pune, Kanpur, Sabur, Nagpur, Faisalabad, which is now in Pakistan, and Coimbatore. So these were the six places where six colleges were established in 1905. Another significant development was the establishment of ICR in 1929, which is an autonomous body which was started on the recommendation of the Royal Commission on Agriculture in 1926. Another some important central commodity committees were constituted mainly for commercial crops and which are the, uh, which are the important crops are here written below that the important committees on cotton was started in the year 1921 okay so remember this year one by one for cotton the committee was constituted in 1921 for luck 1931 for jute 1936 for sugarcane 1944 for coconut 1945 and tobacco also same 1945 and for oil seeds 1947 for arikanut 1949 and the last one your spices and cassonet it is 1958 so remember this year it is the most important facts okay next we will know what is extension system of icf so first we will know organization structure of ICR. Here different persons or bodies are appointed to regulate the ICR. So here first your Indian Minister of Agriculture is the ex officio president of the ICR society. Then secretary DEAR it is Department of Agriculture Research and Education shortly it is called as DEAR Ministry of Agriculture, Government of India and DG. ICR that is your director general ICR is the principal executive officer of the council. Both DG of ICR and secretary of DEAR is the same person. So here another body governing body is the policy making authority then agricultural scientist recruitment board deputy director general eight numbers then additional secretary DEAR and secretary ICR then additional secretary and financial advisor then assistant directors general 24 numbers then national director national agriculture innovation project shortly called as naip then directorate of knowledge management in agriculture so this is the organizational structure of the icr here you can see the picture that indian council of agriculture research and under this icr indian council of agriculture research different bodies are situated just like your technical division for crops, soil, horticulture, agricultural agriculture, engineering, animal science, fisheries, etc. Another is NRCs, 
and national research centers, counter research projects, ICN institutes under ICN Institute Krishi Vigyan Kendra and it is associated then voluntary organizations also here and the division of agriculture extension journal coordination uh, units are these all are functioning under the Indian Council of Agriculture Research and for whom it is functioning it is for the farm families and ultimately it is reaching to the rural people okay here you can see clearly that all things are for the farm families figure one okay so this is the organization structure of ICR okay next we will know some important facts about ICR which are mostly coming in your exams so first is ICR established at 16 July 1929 then ICR headquarters at New Delhi the Council Indian Council of Agriculture Research shortly called as ICR is an autonomous organization which one is the largest national agriculture systems in the world that is your ICR then National Agricultural Science Museum NASM situated in the National Agriculture Science Center campus of ICR in New Delhi then the Indian Council of Agriculture Research ICR is an autonomous organization under the Department of Agriculture Research and Education that is shortly called as DARE Ministry of Agriculture and Farmers Welfare Government of India then the Indian Council of Agriculture Research ICR formerly known as what Imperial Ag Imperial Council of Agriculture Research IRA also like that okay IRA also like that already we have read that one who is the apex body for coordinating guiding and managing research and education in agriculture uh, including horticulture fisheries and animal sciences in the entire country that is your the council is the okay then ICR has played a major role in what promoting excellence in higher education in agriculture then ICR established under which act under society's registration act 1860 then ICR established in pursuance of the report of the Royal Commission on Agriculture then for making a visible impact on the national food and nutritional security the ICR has played a pioneering role in ushering green revolution and subsequent developments in agriculture in India through its research and technology development that has enabled the country to increase the production of food grains by 5.4 times since 1951 to 2017 and for horticulture crops by 10.1 times since 1951 to uh, 2017 and for fish that is 15.2 times and for meals in 9.7 times and for eggs in uh, that is your 48.1 times so in eggs it is increased more since 1951 to 2017 okay let's know some ICR milestone initiation of the first AICRP that is your all India counter research project was started on the crop maize in 1957 then status of deemed university accorded IARA IARA status of deemed university accorded to IRA in 1958 then establishment of the first state agriculture university on land grant pattern on which pattern on land grant pattern then establishment of the first state agriculture university SEU in 1960 in the year 1960 and at which place that is your Panthanagar then placement of different agriculture research institutes under the a peer view of ICR in 1966 then creation of department of agriculture research and education dear in the ministry of agriculture uh, started in the year 1973 remember this dear uh, started in 1973 then opening of first Krishi Vigyan Kendra KVK at Pondicherry or Puducherry in 1974 then establishment of agriculture research service ARS and agriculture scientist recruitment board ASRB in 1975 
then launching of lab to land program and the national agriculture research project NARP in the year 1979 then initiation of institution village linkage program IVLP in 1995 then establishment of national gene bank at new delhi in 1996 then the icr was bestowed with the king bodhin award in the year 1989 okay then the icr was bestowed with the king bodhin award for what valuable contribution in ushering the green revolution then again awarded King Bodin Award in 2004. Then again awarded King Bodin Award for that is uh, for wh what purpose? For research and development efforts made under partnership in Rice Wheat Consortium. National Agriculture Technology Project, National Agriculture Technology Project NATP launched in the year 1998. Then National Agriculture Innovation Project NAIP launched in Ju July 2005. Okay. Next, we'll know some mandates of ICR. Here, four major mandates are written, and it is from the ICR website. And first mandate is the plan, undertake, coordinate, and promote research and technology development for sustainable agriculture. Our purpose is to develop such technology and research which will be sustainable. Okay, next is your add, impart, and coordinate agriculture research, agriculture education to enable quality human resource development. Next is your human resource development. Then third one is your frontline extension for technology application, adoption, knowledge management, and capacity development for agri-based rural development. Okay, and fourth one is your policy, cooperation, and consultancy in agriculture research, education, and extension. So, these are the four mandates. Here, first is your sustainable agriculture. Sustainable means your without affecting the environment, we have to promote research and technology develop. And second one is the improve the quality of human resource development by means of agriculture education also. Then, Third one is your frontline extension. Then fourth one is your policy and cooperation and consultancy in agriculture research, education and extension. Remember these four mandates mostly come in your exam. Then organizational setup of ICR at the present scenarios. So here uh, now here uh, in the today's date it is uh, 11. 11 September 2019 11 September 2019 11 it is of 11 September 2019 so these are the facts okay or requirements minister of ICR honorable in Indian minister of agriculture and farmers welfare and president of ICR is the Narendra Sri Narendra Singh Tomar and honorable minister of state is Sri Kailas Chaudhary then present DG of ICR director general of ICR is the Dr. Tilachan Mahapatra then national bureau of agriculturally important insect NBAII established in the year 2019 national bureau of agriculturally important insects NBAII formally it is called as Project Directorate of Biological Control PDBC and BAII that is formerly it was called as PDBC. Okay. Then next question is your which institute is a nodal institute at a national level for research and development on all aspects of work on harnessing resources of insects including biological control of crop pests and weeds training information repository technology dissemination and national or international cooperation is your national bureau of agriculture important insects nbai a national bureau of agriculture important microorganism nbaim at 
mau up mau up then national bureau of agriculturally important microorganism and bim established in 2005 next is your the handbook of agriculture updated as 6th edition in 2009 then na niasm national institute of abiotic stress management at maligaon maharashtra niasm national institute of abiotic stress management established in 2008 now we are going to know about some icer updated data on 25 8 2019 so here it is the updated data on the date 25 8 2019 so it is changing so you just check from icer website and you can update the data and later case okay here deemed universities are six to newly that is your NARM NAM Hyderabad and NIASM that is your Maligao Maharashtra next institutions are 64 64 numbers of institutions are here then national research centers and are 15 numbers then national bureaus uh, that is six to new NBAIA Bangalore and NBAIM Mao UP then your directories or project directories are 13 numbers then central agriculture universities CAUs are three numbers then state agriculture university SEUs are 64 numbers and KBKs are 706 706 numbers are there okay and ASCRPs are of uh, 60 numbers network projects are of 20 numbers other projects are of 10 numbers so next we will know that in details what are the deemed universities six deemed universities iari that is called as i indian agricultural research institute situated at new delhi ndri national dairy research institute at kannal then ivri indian veterinary research institute at ijatnagar then cpa central institute on fisheries education mumbai then narm and ar narm national Academy of Agricultural Research and Management, Hyderabad, NISM at in your Maligao Maharashtra, it is the NISM means National Institute of Abiotic Stress Management, then institutions, 64 institutions, that is your CARI, uh, Central Island, Central Island Agricultural Research Institute at Port Blair, then Kajri, CAJRI, Central Arid Zone Research Institute, Jodhpur, then CARI, CARI, uh, Central Avian Research Institute, Ijatnagar. Then CIFRI, C Central Inland Fisheries Research Institute, situated at Barakpur. Then SIBA, CIBA, SIBA, Central Institute, Breakwater Aquaculture, uh, situated at Chennai. Then CIRB, Central Institute for Research on Buffaloes, uh, situated at Hisar. Then CIRG, Central Institute for Research on Goats at Magdum. Then CIAE, Central Institute of Agriculture Engineering at Bhopal. Then CIAH, Central Institute for Arid Horticulture at Bikaner. Then CICR, Central Institute of Cotton Research, Nagpur. Okay. Then your CIFT, Central Institute of Fisheries Technology at Cochin. Then Central Institute of Freshwater Aquaculture, shortly called as CIFA, is at Bhubaneswar. Then your number 13, CIR City, Central Institute of Research on Cotton Technology, that is your Mumbai, situated at Mumbai. Then CISH, Central Institute of Subtropical Horticulture, that is at Lucknow. Then CITS, Central Institute of Temperate Horticulture, that is at Srinagar. Then CI, CI PhET, that is situated at uh, Ludhiana and its full form is uh, Central Institute on Post Harvest Engineering and Technology. Then CMFRI, Central Marine Fisheries Research Institute at Kochi. Then CMFRI, CMFRI, Central Marine Fisheries Research Institute at Kochi. Okay. 
then CPCRI Central Plantation Crop Research Institute at Kasargad, then CPRI Central Potato Research Institute at Simla, then Krijap CRI JF Krijap that is your Central Research Institute for Jute and Allied Fibers at Barakpur, then Krida CRIDA Central Research Institute of Dryland Agriculture at Hyderabad, then NRRI National Research Rice Research Institute NRRI ICR NRRI is situated at Katak, Odisha then CSWRI Central Sheep and Old Research Institute the, at Abhikanagar, Rajasthan then IISWC Indian Institute of Soil and Water Conservation at Dehradun then CSSRI Central Soil Sanitary Research Institute at Karnal then CTRI Central Tobacco Research Institute at Rajmundri, then CTCRI Central Tuber Crop Research Institute at Trivandrum, then ICR RCER is that is your ICR research complex for Eastern Region is at Patna, then ICR RCNES that is ICR research complex for NH region huh? uh, that is at Barapani then CCARI CCARI Central Coastal Agriculture Research Institute Ela Go Ola Go Old Goa Goa then 31 IASRI ISRI Indian Agriculture Statistics Research Institute at New Delhi then IGFRI Indian Grassland and Fodder Research Institute, Jhansi. Okay. Then IIAB, Indian Institute of Agriculture Biotechnology at uh, your Ranchi. Then IIHR, Indian Institute of Horticulture Research uh, at Bangalore. Then IINRG, Indian Institute of Natural Resins and Gums at uh, Ranchi. Then IIPR, Indian Institute of Pulses Research at Kanpur. Then IISS, Indian Institute of Soil Science at Bhopal. Then IISR, Indian Institute of Spices Research at Calicut. Then IASR, again, uh, Indian Institute of Sugarcane Research is Lucknow. Uh, then IIBR, Indian Institute of uh, Vegetable Research at Baranasi. Then NARM, National Academy of Agriculture Research and Management, Hyderabad. Then NIBSM, National Institute of Biotic Stress Management, Raipur. Okay, then NIBSM, National Institute of Biotic Stress Management, Raipur already told. Then NIASM, National Institute of Biotic Stress Management at Maligao, Maharashtra. Then NIANM, National Institute of Animal Nutrition and uh, Physiology, Bangalore. Then NIRJFT at, uh, at Kolkata, that is your uh, NIRJAPT, National Institute of Research on Jute and Allied Fiber Technology. Then NIVEDI, N-I-V-E-D-I, uh, that is National Institute of Veterinary Epidemiology and uh, Disease Informatics at Hebel, uh, Bangalore. Then SBI, Sugarcane Breeding Institute at Coimbatore. Then VPKAS, Vivekananda. Uh, Parvati Krishi Anusandhan Sansthan uh, at Almora, then CISRC Central Institute for Research on Cattle, Merit UP, then NIHSAD, that is your National Institute of High Security Animal Diseases, Bhopal, then IAMR, Indian Institute of Major Research, New Delhi, then CAFRI, Central Agroforestry Research Institute, Jhansi. Then NIAP, National, research, uh, National Institute of Agriculture, Economics and Policy Research, New Delhi. Okay. Then, your, oh, it is IIWBR, Research Institute of Wheat and Bali Research at Karnal. Then IA. A FSR Indian Institute of Farming System Research at Modipuram, then IAMR uh, your Indian Institute of Millet Research uh, at Hyderabad, then IO IIOR Indian Institute of Oil Seed Research at Hyderabad, then IAOPR Indian Institute of Oil Palm Research at uh, Peda 
Pedavizi, West Godavari, then uh, IAWM, Indian Institute of Water Management at Bhuvaneswar, then IARR, Indian Institute of Rice Research at Hyderabad, then CIWA, Central Institute for Women in Agriculture at Siwa at Bhuvaneswar, then CCRI, Central, uh, Central Citrus Research Institute at Nagpur, then IASR, Indian Institute of Seed Research, MAO, then IARI, Indian Agriculture Research Institute at Hajaribagh, Jharkhand. Now we will know uh, 15 National Research Centers, NRC. Okay, so ICR NRC, that is for uh, NRC on banana is at Trichy. Okay, then grapes for NRC for grapes at Pune, for Lichy at Mujafarpur, for Promganet at Solapur, for Camel at Bekaner, for Equins at Hisar, for Meat uh, Hyderabad, then for Mithun that is Medjifema uh, Nagaland, then Orchids Pekyong Sikkim, then for Fig Guwahati, for uh, Plant Biotechnology that is uh, New Delhi. Then your seed spices that is your asmir, then yak for yak uh, that is west kemang, then integrated farming, uh, for NRC for integrated farming, ICR NRCIF, it is Motihari, Motihari, and ICR NRC, uh, ICR National Center for Integrated Pest Management is at New Delhi. Okay. Next six bureaus, uh, that is first is. Uh, ICR National Bureau of Plant Genetic Resources that is your uh, at uh, New Delhi then for agriculture important microorganisms at Mao UP then for agriculture inst insect resources at Bengaluru then soil survey and land use planning uh, Nagpur and for animal genetic resources at Karnal then fish genetic resources at uh, Lucknow, okay. Then we'll know some directors and project directors. Thirteen directors and or project directors. Here it is ICR director research on groundnut at Junagad, for soybean at Indore, for rap seed and mustard that is your uh, Bharatpur. Then for mushroom Solan, onion and garlic at uh, Pune. Then case for cashew at uh, Puttur, uh, for medicinal and aromatic plants at Anand, for floricultural uh, at uh, Pune, Maharashtra, for wheat at Jabalpur, food and for food and mouth that is your Mukteswar, then for poultry Hyderabad, knowledge management in agriculture DKMA at uh, your New Delhi, and for your cold water fisheries at Bhimtal. Nainital. Okay. Next, we'll know Central Agriculture Universities. That is of three numbers. So, CAU Central Agriculture University at Imphal, Manipur, and next RLB CAU that is your Rani Lakshmi Bai Central Agriculture University at Jhansi, UP. Then RPCAU uh, at uh, Dr. Rajendra Prasad Central Agriculture University, Pusa, Samastipur. Okay. Then state agriculture universities that is of 64 numbers that is of 64 numbers here it is first year uh, in Andhra Pradesh that is three three numbers are here Angrao Angrao that is Achara Enjirangwa agriculture university at Guntur then Dr. YSRHU APHU Dr. YSR horticulture university at Bankata Ramana, Bankata Ramana Gudem, then your SBBU, Sri Bankata Swara Veterinary University at Tirupati, then in Assam, AU, Agric Assam Agriculture University, Jorhat, then in Bihar, uh, BAU and BSO, two are there, Bihar Agriculture University at Sabor Bhagalpur, and Bihar Animal Science University, Sciences University at Patna, then in Chhattisgarh, IGKB, CGKB. IGKB that is Indra Gandhi Kisivisya Vidyalaya Raipur 
एंड छत्तीसगढ़ कामधेनु विश्वविद्यालय दुर्ग ओके देन इन गुजरात देन इन गुजरात देर इज ए फाइव सी यूज आर हेयर सो सरदार फास्ट इज एस डी ए यू सरदार कृषिनगर दंतेवाड़ा एग्रीकल्चर यूनिवर्सिटी एट दंतेवाड़ा देन ए यू आनंद एग्रीकल्चर यूनिवर्सिटीज एट आनंद देन नवसारी एग्रीकल्चर यूनिवर्सिटी एन ए यू एट नवसारी देन जे यू जूनागढ़ एग्रीकल्चर यूनिवर्सिटी एट जूनागढ़ देन के यू कामधेनु यूनिवर्सिटी एट गांधीनगर देन हरियाणा इन हरियाणा थ्री एस ए यू जर हेयर सी सी एस एच ए यू चौधरी चरण सिंह एग्रीकल्चर यूनिवर्सिटी एट हिसार देन एल यू भी एस लाला लजपत राय यूनिवर्सिटी ऑफ वेटनरी एंड एनिमल एनिमल साइंसेस एट हिसार देन एच एस यू एच एस हरियाणा स्टेट यूनिवर्सिटी ऑफ हॉर्टिकल्चर साइंसेस एट कन्नाल देन हिमाचल प्रदेश सी एस के एच पी के भी एट चौध सारवन कुमार हिमा हिमाचल प्रदेश कृषि विश्वविद्यालय एट पालमपुर देन वाई एस पी यू एस एफ डॉक्टर यशवंत सिंह पार्मर यूनिवर्सिटी ऑफ हॉर्टिकल्चर एंड फॉरेस्ट्री एट सोलन देन इन झारखंड बी ए यू बिरसा एग्रीकल्चर यूनिवर्सिटी रांची देन जम्मू एंड कश्मीर एस के यू ए एस टी सैरिक कश्मीर यूनिवर्सिटी ऑफ एग्रीकल्चरल साइंस एंड टेक्नोलॉजी एट श्रीनगर देन एस के यू ए एस टी सैर कश्मीर यूनिवर्सिटी ऑफ एग्रीकल्चर साइंस एंड टेक्नोलॉजी एट जम्मू देन कर्नाटका इन कर्नाटका देर इज सिक्स एस सी यू जर यू एस यूनिवर्सिटी ऑफ एग्रीकल्चर साइंस बेंगलोरु देन के भी ए एफ एस यू कर्नाटका भेटनरी एनिमल एंड फिशरीज साइंसेस यूनिवर्सिटी बिदर देन यू एस यूनिवर्सिटी ऑफ एग्रीकल्चर साइंस रायचूर देन इन यू एस धारवाड़ देन यू एच एस यूनिवर्सिटी ऑफ हॉर्टिकल्चर साइंस बागालकोट देन यू एच एस यूनिवर्सिटी ऑफ एग्रीकल्चर एंड हॉर्टिकल्चर साइंस सिमोगा ओके नेक्स्ट इन केरला के यू केरला एग्रीकल्चर यूनिवर्सिटी त्रिसूर देन के यू एफ ओ एस केरला यूनिवर्सिटी ऑफ फिशरीज एंड ओशियन स्टडीज पनानगर कोची देन के भी ए एस यू केरला भेटनरी एंड एनिमल साइंसेस यूनिवर्सिटी पोकोड़े वयनान केरला देन मध्य प्रदेश आर भी एस के भी वी राजमाता विजय राजे सिंधिया कृषि विश्वविद्यालय ग्वालियर देन एन डी एन डी भी एस यू एन डी भी एस यू नानाजी देशमुख पशु चिकित्सा विश्वविद्यालय जबलपुर देन जी एन के भी भी जवाहरलाल नेहरू कृषि विश्वविद्यालय जबलपुर देन महाराष्ट्र डी बी एस के के भी डॉक्टर बाला साहेब सावंत कोकन कृषि विद्यापीठ एट दापोली देन एम ए एफ एस यू महाराष्ट्र एनिमल एंड फिशरीज साइंस यूनिवर्सिटी नागपुर देन भी एन एम के भी बसंत राव नायक मार्थवाड़ा कृषि विद्यापीठ परवानी देन एम पी के भी मातातम फुले कृषि विद्यापीठ एट राहुरी देन पी टी के वी और पी के वी डॉक्टर पंजाब राव देशमुख कृषि विश्वविद्यालय एट अकोला देन ओडिशा इन ओडिशा वन यूनिवर्सिटी एस सी यूज इज हेयर ओ यू टी ओडिशा यूनिवर्सिटी ऑफ एग्रीकल्चर एंड टेक्नोलॉजी भुवनेश्वर देन पंजाब इन पंजाब जी ए डी भी एस यू और गुरु अंगद देव भेटनरी एंड एनिमल साइंस यूनिवर्सिटी लुधियाना देन पी ए यू पंजाब एग्रीकल्चर यूनिवर्सिटी लुधियाना देन राजस्थान इन राजस्थान महा एम पी यू ए टी महाराणा प्रताप यूनिवर्सिटी ऑफ एग्रीकल्चर एंड टेक्नोलॉजी उदयपुर देन एस के आर स्वामी केशवानंद राजस्थान एग्रीकल्चर यूनिवर्सिटी बीकानेर देन आर जे यू भी ए एस राजस्थान यूनिवर्सिटी ऑफ वेटनरी एंड एनिमल साइंसेस बीकानेर देन एस के एन ए यू श्री करण नरेंद्र एग्रीकल्चर यूनिवर्सिटी जॉब जॉबनेर देन ए यू एग्रीकल्चर यूनिवर्सिटी एट कोटा देन ए यू एग्रीकल्चर यूनिवर्सिटी जोधपुर तमिलनाडु एट तमिलनाडु टी एन ई यू तमिलनाडु एग्रीकल्चर यूनिवर्सिटी कोयम्बाटूर 
देन टी एन यू भी ए एस तमिलनाडु भेटनरी एंड एनिमल साइंसेस यूनिवर्सिटी एट चेन्नई देन टी एन एफ यू तमिलनाडु फिशरीज यूनिवर्सिटीज नागापटनम ओके देन इन तेलंगाना इन तेलंगाना थ्री एस यू जारी है एस के एल टी एस एच यू और श्री कोंडा श्रीकोंडा लक्ष्मण तेलंगाना स्टेट हॉर्टिकल्चर यूनिवर्सिटी हैदराबाद देन पी वी एन आर टी वी यू और श्री पी वी नरसिम्हा राव तेलंगाना भेटनरी यूनिवर्सिटी हैदराबाद देन पी जे टी एस यू प्रोफेसर जयशंकर तेलंगाना स्टेट एग्रीकल्चर यूनिवर्सिटी एट हैदराबाद देन इन उत्तराखंड जी बी पी यू ए टी गोविंद बल्लभ पंत एग्री यूनिवर्सिटी ऑफ एग्रीकल्चर एंड टेक्नोलॉजी एट पंतनगर मोस्ट इम्पोर्टेंट वन दिस इज ओके जी बी पी यू ए टी देन भी सी एस जी यू यू एच एफ भी सी एस जी योर उत्तराखंड यूनिवर्सिटी ऑफ हॉर्टिकल्चर एंड फॉरेस्ट्री एट भरसर देन इन यू पी सी एस ए यू ए टी दैट इज चंद्रशेखर आजाद यूनिवर्सिटी ऑफ एग्रीकल्चर एंड टेक्नोलॉजी कानपुर देन एन डी यू ए टी नरेंद्र देव यूनिवर्सिटी ऑफ एग्रीकल्चर एंड टेक्नोलॉजी फैजाबाद देन एस बी पी एस एस बी बी पी यू ए टी सरदार वल्लभ भाई पटेल यूनिवर्सिटी ऑफ एग्रीकल्चर एंड टेक्नोलॉजी मीरठ देन डी यू भी ए एस यू यू पी पंडित दीनदयाल उपाध्याय पशु चिकित्सा विज्ञान विश्वविद्यालय एवं गो अनुसंधान संस्था एट मथुरा देन बी यू ए टी बंद यूनिवर्सिटी ऑफ एग्रीकल्चर एंड टेक्नोलॉजी बंद देन बी एच यू बी एच यू ए टी एस शाम हगिन बचम यूनिवर्सिटी ऑफ एग्रीकल्चर टेक्नोलॉजी एंड साइंसेस अलाहाबाद एंड इन वेस्ट बेंगल बी सी के वी विधान चंद्र कृषि विश्वविद्यालय बी सी के वी मोहनपुर इम्पोर्टेंट वन ओके डब्ल्यू बी यू ए एफ एस सी वेस्ट बेंगल यूनिवर्सिटी ऑफ एनिमल एंड फिशरीज साइंसेस कोलकाता देन यू बी के वी उत्तर बंग कृषि विश्वविद्यालय एट कोच बिहार ओके दीज आर दी एस सी यूज हुई आर सिचुएटेड इन इंडिया ओके नाउ कम टू नो अबाउट ए आई सी आर पीस ऑल इंडिया कॉन्टेंट रिसर्च प्रोजेक्ट्स विच इज ऑफ फिफ्टी नाइन नंबर्स इन इंडिया सो फर्स्ट योर योर ऑन निमा टोड दैट इज ए आई सी आर पी ऑन निमा टोड्स एट न्यू डेली ऑन मेज ऑल्सो एट न्यू डेली फॉर राइस एट हैदराबाद एंड फॉर सरगम ऑल्सो दैट इज एट हैदराबाद राइस एंड सरगम बोथ आर एट हैदराबाद एंड फॉर चिकपी चिकपी मूलर पिजन पी एडेड लेग्यूम्स बोथ ऑल आर एट कानपुर ओके ऑल आर एट कानपुर देन हुईट एंड बार्ली इम्प्रूवमेंट प्रोजेक्ट एट कन्नल देन फर सरगम इट इज हैदराबाद ऑलरेडी टोल्ड पल मिलेट इज एट जोधपुर फॉर स्मॉल मिलेट दैट इज एट बैंगलोर देन शुगर कैन एट लखनऊ देन कॉटन एट कोयम्बाटूर देन ग्राउंड नट एट जूनागढ़ देन सोयाबीन एट इंदौर एंड ए आई सी एल पी ऑन रेपसीड एंड मस्टर्ड एट भरतपुर ओके नेक्स्ट ए आई सी एल पी ऑन सनफ्लावर साफ फ्लावर कास्टर एट हैदराबाद देन ए आई सी एल पी ऑन लिनसीड कानपुर देन ए आई सी एल पी ऑन सेसम एंड नाइजर एट जबलपुर ऑन आई पी एम एंड बाई कंट्रोल एट बैंगलोर फॉर हनी बी रिसर्च एंड ट्रेनिंग एट हिसार देन ऑन एन एस पी क्रॉप्स एट माओ माओ देन माओ देन फॉरेज क्रॉप्स एट झांसी देन फ्रूट्स बैंगलोर एरिड जोन फ्रूट्स बीकानेर मशरूम सोलान भेजिटेबल्स इंक्लूडिंग एन एस पी भेजिटेबल्स एट वाराणसी देन पटाटो शिमला टीवर क्रॉप्स तिरुवनंतपुरम देन पाम्स कसरगढ़ कैस्यू पुटूर स्पाइसेस कलिकट मेडिसन एरोमेटिक प्लांट्स इंक्लूडिंग बेटल भाइन आनंद फ्लोरिकल्चर न्यू डेली देन 
ASRP on micro secondary and pollutant elements in soil and plants Bhopal then soil test with crop response Bhopal long term fertilizer experiments at Bhopal both are uh, these three are in Bhopal then your salt affected soils and use of saline water in agriculture at Kernel then water management research at Bhubaneswar, groundwater utilization is also at Bhubaneswar, then dry land agriculture and uh, agro metrology including network impact adaptation and vulnerability of Indian agriculture uh, to climate change at Hyderabad. Okay. Integrated farming system research including network organic farming at Modipuram, then weed control at Jabalpur, then agroforestry at Jhasi, then farm implements and uh, machinery at Bhopal, then economics and safety in agriculture also in India, then uh, energy in agriculture and uh, agro based inputs at uh, Bhopal, utilization of animal energy UAE at Bhopal. Then plastic culture, engineering and technology, Ludhiana. Again, PhD post harvest technology at Ludhiana. Then goat improvement, Mathura. Then improvement of feed sources and nutrient utilization uh, for raising animal production at Bangalore. Then cattle research, Mirat. Then poultry, Hyderabad. Pig, Ijatnagar. For foot and mouth disease at Mukteswar. Then ADMS. Uh, at uh, your admas at Bangalore then home science at Bhumneswar okay you can categorize uh, on the basis of your uh, state also or any place also so that it will be easy to remember okay next come to know about network projects that is of 20 numbers so here all India network project on pesticide residues and Underutilized crops both are at New Delhi. Okay, then All India Network Project on Tobacco at Ranjmundri. Then All India Network Project on Soil Arthropod Pest at uh, Durgapura. Network on your agricultural acrology at Bangalore. Bangalore. Then Network on Economic or Nithology at Hyderabad. Then All India Network Project on Rodent Control at uh, Jodhpur. Then All India Network Project on Jute and Allied Fibers at Barakpur. Then Network Project on Improvement of Onion and Garlic at Pune. Then Network Biofertilizer at Bhopal. Then Network Project on Harvest and Post Harvest and Value Addition to Natural Resins and Gums at Ranchi. Network Project on Animal Genetic Resources at Kernel. Then Network Project on R&D Support. Uh, rural and development support for process operation of indigenous milk products for industrial application at kernel then network program on sheep improvement at abhikanagar then network project on buffalo's improvement at hisar then network on uh, gastrointestinal part citizen at uh, ijatnagar and also uh, for emo Hemorrhagic uh, septicemia at also Ijatnagar and another one blue tongue disease also at Ijatnagar. Then network project on conservation of lack insect uh, genetic resources at Ranchi. Then network project on agricultural bioinformatics and computational, uh, computational biology at uh, New Delhi. Next we will know extension system of SEUs. For improving the standard and quality of agriculture, education, research and field extension, agriculture universities were started in each state since 1960. Okay, 1960 at first uh, started at your Pantanagar. Okay, GBPOT. So, first we will know role of universities in the field of extension. It is for mainly three uh, three role that is your responsible for conducting training programs and field trials on farmers field to test the research findings and their applicability at field level. So whatever the research is going on in the institution that should be a uh, trial in the field of the farmers whether it is uh, perfectly applicable in the real situation or not. Okay, and also conduct training programs also to 
educate or learn the farmers okay to train the farmers second point is your extension agency is a feedback of agriculture university extension agency also is a feedback of agriculture university third point come to act as a it is act as a primary source of agriculture information and also undertakes training of extension functionaries of the development departments and education training institutions okay then come to that the university education commission 1949 headed by dr sarvapalli radhakrishnan recommended the establishment of rural universities in india who is recommended dr sarvapalli radhakrishnan okay when he was headed on the university education commission 1949 first agriculture university then came into existence in the year 1960 at pantnagar the extension role of agriculture universities is presented below okay here you can see that the according to that uh, report of the review committee of agriculture university headed by dr m s randhwa 1978 so here the roles mainly categorized into three categories that is your teaching research and extension so first is your teaching teaching to train and produce professional for teaching research and field extension work and provide dynamic leadership to extension programs through a systematic and integrated ug and pg teaching in extension education so here we are providing teaching in the institution okay to the students so that they will be well trained and be a professionals in teaching research for teaching research and field extension work okay and they will go to the farmers field and they can teach or train something to them second work is second role is research in extension education to undertake a research on various facets of extension with a view to enriching program formulation and operation and to develop new methodology and approach for speedy transfer of new technology to farm and farm homes okay we have to create such research where it can reach to the farmers in a easier way new technology should be developed okay and it should reach to the farmers in a easier way okay then third one is your extension function of extension education or that uh, your first is your conduct survey and pinpoint farmers problem for research first work is to conduct survey and pinpoint we have to find out the problems need of the farmers so that we can uh, know uh, what is the need and accordingly we can do the proper mechanism or we can create such type of, or do research on that particular need and we can develop new technology to solve their problem or need then second point is conduct adaptive on farm trial with advanced research materials in farmers field okay after that you have to conduct adaptive on farm trials with advanced research materials so that whether it is applicable in the in the particular uh, farmers or the beneficiary farmers in a correct way or not we can know okay then conduct frontline demonstration in farmers fields on the technologies recommended by the research then we have to conduct the frontline demonstration then provide advisory services to the farmers then we have to provide advisory services through different uh, now uh, some apps are there rice expert app also there okay rice expert expert app also there Uh, for advice services and before that uh, this technology uh, direct contact with the scientist is possible uh, only the uh, to get advices but now we can get advice through our internet and mobiles also next is your conduct training programs conduct training program for farmers and extension agent so next is to conduct any program to conduct conduct training program for farmers both farmers and extension agents required training so that they will be well educated and well trained if extension agent will not get 
proper training then how can a, he or she can uh, disseminate the technology so that is the important one is provide information communication support for extension work okay next uh, we have to what to do we have to provide information communication support to the extension worker and for the extension work next seven number is evaluate the extent to which the project work has been successful and identify deficiencies and problems for further research then you have to find out and evaluate the how much the project work has successful and we have to find out that how much need required another further research required we should know that what are the deficiencies still or what is the lacuna still there so we can do further research on that one and improve that work so like i said also here seus are uh, there and under seu or faculties or agriculture uh, college of agriculture horticulture veterinary dairy agriculture different branches are there and then uh, directorate of research are there ha huh? then uh, directorate of extension under directorate of, uh, of extension kisi vigyan kendraj voluntary organization are there then ultimately it is reaching to the farm families okay like i said also here it is also reaching to the farm families and rural people so our motive is to improve the socio status of the farm people we have to increase or improve the well being of the farm people and rural people okay so this much only in this today's discussion thank you for listening have a good day